Hello. All right, guys. So I, I kind of messed up. I should have just made this video like hours ago. Once I get back to work, but nope. I just decided to sleep for a moment, and <laughs> everyone has already have their opinions on it. So yeah, I hate everything. I made a video about this, and some of the points in this video are kind of similar. But yeah, whatever. Like, like, like. Let's talk about the the new YouTube rewind. Okay, before that. I gotta say, this whole video gonna be like my own opinion and my thought about it. So, yeah, whatever. What, what the, what, whatever, guys. Let's just jump right. There are three main reasons why I hate this thing. This thing sucks so badly. All right, there are many, many reasons wrong with this. All right. Let's start with the fucking obvious. How the fuck Fortnite gets so little fucking f screen time? Fortnite is the biggest games in 2018. Alongside with God of War that somehow didn't made it. How the fuck God of War were not included in the goddamn YouTube Rewind? Everyone still play the exact same game. How? How the hell does God of War were not included? I don't, I don't fucking know. And somehow, despite being big and powerful or influential, freaking Fortnite got such a fraction. Like, how the hell is that even happening? There's a short clip of Fortnite dance, like, towards the middle, like, towards the end. How is that possible? They jump straight to Fortnite after a short Will Smith. For some reason, we get Will Smith. How? We got no PewDiePie. How? No Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, no others. Just straight out Will Smith. The fuck? The next thing we get, we got fucking... Like, like, like what? Michael Keaton? Michael fucking Keaton or what the fuck? Alright, now where's my fucking Tom Holland? Freaking Spider-Man Homecoming. Like... Freaking cameo, whatever. Basically, how the hell that Fortnite, despite being the biggest games... In YouTube 2018, get so little time. How? Also, can we just talk about that baby shark? How the fuck we get baby shark again? Does baby shark a, th a thing in 2018? Cause I remember that shit came from 2017. If if I'm not mistaken, I'm sorry if it, if I were mistaken, I'm, you can ignore this point completely. But how? How the fuck we get baby shark? No one talks about Baby Shark in this in 2018. All they talk about was Johnny Johnny Yes Papa, and we do not get that. We do not get Johnny Johnny Yes Papa. Yes, there is no Johnny Johnny Yes Papa. I'm sorry, you bastard who like this fucking song, but no, you ain't got it. Suck it up, boys. Well, let's see, well, what next? We got mukbang. We got K-pop and mukbang. How the fuck is that also even possible? Mukbang was older than my goddamn grandpa. How the fuck is that even possible? Mukbang was from 2010, 2013. That's almost like five years ago. Probably even 2014. I don't fucking care. It, the, the point is, it's old. It's really old. Alright? It's old. How the fuck is that even possible? There's that one PewDiePie meme, that's Bongo Cat, and that's it. Oh yeah, by the way, there's this, there is no motherfucking Infinity War memes. Can you imagine that? No Infinity War, I don't feel so good, I don't feel so good, bitch of time, bitch of time. Fucking dispersed. No, there is no Infinity War memes. Can you believe that? I, I legit only looking for that, how the fuck? Does, 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 how the fuck does Infinity War, one of the most, one of the biggest movie that came out in 2018, the accumulation of every single Marvel movie, somehow didn't make it? I don't know. I don't know. I really don't, I really don't know. How the fuck is it even possible? Alright, that's the first part. There's so many motherfucking points lost. There's no TikTok. TikTok is a big deal for the for the last couple months and I didn't include them. 
There's no Thai pod. Well, okay, okay. That, there's no Thai pod. Okay. But the K-pop? How the fuck is K-pop? There's this one point where there was like, oh, we need more K-pop. We need K-pop. How the fuck we need K-pop? K-pop is not 28. K-pop has been around for a long time. Why the fuck you decide to put them now, YouTube? I need answer now. Alright? Alright, let's 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 talk about number two because it was the worst one. This I'm pretty sure some of you already know this or 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 already or or already said it, you know? It's about that part where they're bragging about oh we need to acknowledge all these people who have helped develop I don't I don't fucking care. I, I legit don't fucking care about all these people. Yeah, I said it. I get it, you do charity, you help people, yes I know. But can you stop bragging about how good they are? If you really want to make them acknowledge, how about you acknowledge people who really help people in real life? Where's the police, the firefighters? There's a lot of fire happening in 2018 and no one mentioning the firefighters. Why? Why? Are, is, it because, is it because they are not YouTubers and they don't deserve some love? No! It's because no one gives a shit. That part is just to drag on the goddamn video with some fake ass, with some really fake, this feeling like, oh, we, we feel wonder, we feel the <laughs> disgusting. It's really the most disgusting part of the entire video. And I, and let's talk about the another most disgusting things. Okay, the third point of why YouTube Rewind sucks is because there's this undertone obvious war declaration all right you guys gotta stick with me for this one all right there's this point in one in the video where there's this random chick just say oh we have the chance to do whatever we want with this youtube with this youtube real and i was like whoa woman no no woman no you shouldn't do it you shouldn't say that you should not say that no one's gonna like that but they just did anyway with this most boring ass simplistic motherfucking form of of video this is probably the worst probably the least creative of them all how the fuck does youtube rewind from 2013 is more exciting than this one also regarding the war declaration there's this spot when there's this woman throwing a like like burning the fire camps and then from that fire came youtube comment like i get it you like like you <laughs> It's, it's already so obvious. It's so obvious that now it's no longer just us and content creator hating on YouTube, but then YouTube just stays silent. No, these are literally people hates government, and then the government hates the people back by actually making them suffer. That is the level of hate between us content cre us and the content creators and YouTube I mean fastest YouTube the company there is a literal war declaration from YouTube that says if you're not with me you're against me that's the undertone I get from that point onward and it's become more clear once that simple mindset being put in place because everything again is what we love about YouTube we got celebrities now at the front at the start of the video we got ninja one of the most controversial p person in 2018 more than PewDiePie and yet he get more screen time than PewDiePie think about that this YouTube rewind really really mirrors YouTube as a whole a shallow hollow corporate that reminding us that hey you are either with us and puts a and puts a shit tons of views like all those shitty Johnny Johnny S Papa video or you could have just struggled with your everyday freaking video whatever all right I, I, I think I've been talking a lot too much so yeah, thank you for watching. I can't really upload 10 minutes video now because I don't have that much subscribers. So, thank you guys for watching and yeah, good day and see ya.